We have come out to Brooklyn today to check out a restaurant that's generating a whole lot of excitement from both critics and customers alike. We're at Olmsted in Prospect Heights. Olmsted is a neighborhood restaurant. It is very seasonal. We buy everything from the farmer's market. So what inspired it? This is your first restaurant. I got started at 18. I was at a restaurant called Elenia. Elenia became the best restaurant in the world and all this stuff. And then I worked for Dan Barber. And then Dan Barber's whole thing was not just a creative outlet. There has to be a purpose why you're using that vegetable. And so that is this restaurant, basically. So one of the big selling points here, a garden. Right. So we have these small tables out here that people can have cocktails. So people also sometimes finish their meals with their desserts out here. The idea is the outside is all perennials that will get bushier and bushier over the years. So a lot of it is herbs, flowers, that we do use the lemon balm over there is on the, the, the radish top gazpacho. The radishes grow here. So the things that you are actually growing out here are the things that customers will actually be eating inside. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so we're in the kitchen. We have what we just picked. And what is the dish that we are making? So this is the radish top gazpacho. It's the, the one thing that is more or less entirely from the garden. What's the next dish? So the next one we're going to do is a pea falafel, and then there's pita, our sort of funny, playful version of pita. We have the two dishes that we just prepared. What else did you bring out? So we have uh, our carrots and little neck clams that have uh, been draped in a carrot crepe. The watermelon sushi, the pork, the, it's pork collar. There is. Uh, broccoli rob and uh, gandija chilies. That was amazing. I would definitely come back and order this in a second. So part of the philosophy here is to keep the prices reasonable. Yeah, absolutely. The menu is broken down into snacks, uh, appetizers, and entrees, and desserts, and nothing exceeds $24. Wow, that's very, very affordable for New York prices, especially with the quality of food and the technique that you're using. What is that beautiful dish? So that is frozen yogurt that we make here. And then it's almost like a meringue of lavender honey. The honey comes from Prospect Park. Wow, that's killer. This place is amazing, really so special. Congratulations again. Thank you so much.